France launched airstrikes against an Islamic State training center in Syria on Sunday as its enemy was preparing attacks on France. French Prime Minister Manuel Valls says they were acting in legitimate defense. Frappons Daesh en Syrie, car cette organisation terroriste organise, prépare les attentats vers la France depuis la Syrie, depuis ses sanctuaires, et nous agissons donc en légitime défense. C'est ce que nous permet la charte des Nations Unies, l'article 51, et j'avais dit à l'Assemblée nationale que c'est sur cette base-là que nous devrions intervenir et agir. Val says the camp of Daesh terrorist group was targeted as it was where militants who were striking France were trained. He says as long as it is necessary, France will continue with its operations against its enemy in Syria. Meanwhile, on the sidelines of the United Nations General Assembly in New York, French President François Hollande says that six French jets successfully destroyed the camp. Hollande says they sent reconnaissance flights about three weeks ago to identify the target and he also reiterates that there were no civilian casualties as a result of the attack. Hollande says Syrian President Bashar al-Assad is the main person responsible for the Syrian conflict even though the Daesh terrorist group is to be blamed for atrocities. France considers que l'avenir de la Syrie France considers that the future of Syria cannot be with Bashar al-Assad. Accordingly, during this entire period of time, we must uh, look for this political solution while protecting our interests with some specific targeted military operations that each time must enable us to prevent a number of actions that could be undertaken in our country or actions that could have a terrible impact on the civilian population. We're acting in the name of a principle to find a solution in Syria and to protect ourselves. Et la France agit également pour se protéger. France carried out Sunday's airstrike in Syria independently, though it also joined a coalition led by the United States in the attack against the Islamic State in Iraq and Syria. The coalition's joint task force says the coalition conducted 20 airstrikes in Iraq and three in Syria on Saturday. In Iraq, the coalition jets struck five times at a place near the town of heat-destroying command and control and vehicle bomb-making facilities and one of the Islamic State headquarters. In Syria, the strikes hit and destroyed targets near Al-Hasaka, Abu Kamal and Mar'a.